the options that a credit provider can take in terms of recovering their debt is to put you under sequestration. That means that whatever assets you have and you own will be sold and then any money that is recovered out of that process will then be used to repay the credit provider. But that process is very expensive because it's a court driven process as well. It means that you have to pay the fees. I think it's more than 20,000 for the process. And the other thing is that only people with sufficient assets to satisfy the requirements of the Act can go under sequestration. So if you are a low-income consumer, that process will not work for you. And then once that process has been finalized, it takes 10 years. Your name will be at the credit bureau for 10 years unless you are able to get a court order to say you have been rehabilitated. But that is also means that you have to pay some money to get that through. So also, you know, a last resort, it works for a very few people in the country because a lot of consumers do not have sufficient assets or do not have enough money to be able to go to, through the process. So it can either be forced, that means the credit provider can initiate it, or you can voluntarily initiate it. But very few people use that process.